Yet another dApp coming to internet computer. IC Desk is going to be a decentralized workspace built 100% on internet computer. The core suite of IC Desk is going to consist of IC Files, which is a cloud storage solution, IC Papers, which is a document editor, IC Calc, the spreadsheet application, and IC Canvas, which is a presentation tool. You can catch up with the IC Desk staff on Discord. However, I asked them to create a community in OpenChat and well, they did. IC Desk is available in OpenChat, and you can find them simply by going to Exploring Communities at the bottom left-hand corner of your OpenChat application window and searching for IC Desk. Unfortunately, there is an unknown timeline currently. IC Desk is not available in alpha or beta, and it's certainly not public release at this time. And there is no published roadmap or ETA for the development timeline of IC Desk. Note that the time and date of this recording is 12.45 p.m. Pacific on November 2nd, 2024. Currently, the team consists of three people and I will probably butcher their names but it looks like Mattia D'Elia, Sabino D'Elia, and Laura Militello. Their intent is to build IC Desk 100% on the internet computer blockchain and this means that they will be providing some amount of cycle burn between compute and on-chain storage. Be sure to follow them on X at IC underscore desk. Some of the things that I am liking about this project already, besides the fact that it's a dApp being built on internet computer, is they seem to actually care about Web3 and the intent of Web3, which is decentralization and leveraging on-chain resources such as compute and storage, as well as governance. And by governance, of course, we're referring to decentralized governance, also known as DAO, which is Decentralized Autonomous Organizations. They are currently planning to allow token holders to be able to stake their tokens to participate in decision-making processes, which is the governance, directly influencing the platform's evolution. And by voting on key proposals, upgrades, and policy adjustments, participants will actively shape IC Desk's future, which again is what the DAO are all about. And so, of course, it should come as no surprise that they are mentioning adopting a DAO framework. They're also talking about a commitment to open source. However, only core components of the platform will be open source, fostering transparency and enabling community engagement. Certain elements of the code base that could expose vulnerabilities or compromise IC desk integrity will remain proprietary, which kind of one of the points of having open source software is so that the community, that is members of the community who are tech savvy, specifically with coding or development, can help offer peer review to make sure that software is in fact secure. So although it does kind of make sense that they don't want to expose vulnerabilities to potential bad actors, the again, the entire point of open source or one of the big points of open source is so that people can help make sure that a project is on the up and up it's secure and it's doing what it's supposed to be doing. So this is something that I am less excited about. Hopefully they revise their stance on this particular detail. Their current plans is to launch IC files beta first as part of their phase one, which is basically just going to be on-chain data storage, which is great. However, it's going to be a bit longer before we can actually take a look at their office application alternative applications, allowing you to work on documents, spreadsheets, and presentations. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty curious and kind of anxious to be able to get my hands on dApps like this because I think it would be pretty cool to have yet another alternative to big tech, such as Microsoft Office or Google Docs. I'm already a user of LibreOffice, which is a step away from big technology, but to be able to be a participant and supporter of good dApps on chain like I hope IC Desk will be, that is something that I'm looking forward to.